Did you hear about the nymphomaniac who went to a mind reader? So here's a tale to tickle your funny bones. A nymphomaniac decided to visit a mind reader, curious about what he might discover. The mind reader, though, was in for a surprise. He found himself in a world of sultry thoughts and wild fantasies. But here's the kicker. He charged her half price, claiming that her dirty mind was easy to read. Quite a discount, huh? Well, at least she got a discount, right? Speaking of wild imaginations, have you heard about the nymphomaniac who created a whole love triangle in her mind? Picture this. A woman named Lucy, who finds herself in the throes of an intense love triangle. No ordinary love triangle, mind you. This one involves her, a Hollywood heartthrob, and a Grammy-winning singer. All of this, however, exists solely in her vivid imagination. Our dear Lucy. She's a hopeless romantic with an insatiable appetite for love and, well, a bit of an overactive imagination. One day, she falls head over heels in love with a Hollywood actor after watching his latest rom-com. Add to that, she's also smitten by a singer whose soulful tunes have her heart-skipping beats. Thus, the stage is set for an epic love triangle. In her mind, she's living this whirlwind romance, filled with grand gestures, passionate arguments, and heartfelt reconciliations. She imagines herself at glamorous parties, rubbing shoulders with the who's who of Hollywood. She has heated arguments with the actor over his on-screen love interest, leading to dramatic breakups. But fear not, their love is too strong to be dimmed by such trivial matters. They always find their way back to each other. Meanwhile, the singer is not far behind. He woos her with his soulful tunes and heartfelt lyrics, always there to comfort her when the actor's on-screen romance gets too much for her to handle. They share intimate moments under the starlit sky, their love story unfolding with every note he sings. In her world, she's not just in love. She's in a love triangle, the likes of which would put any soap opera to shame. She lives every moment of it, feeling the highs of being in love, the lows of heartbreak, and the thrill of reconciliation. It's a roller coaster of emotions, and she's enjoying every bit of the ride. But at the end of the day, it's all in her head a figment of her wild imagination, a love triangle that exists nowhere but in her mind. And that, my friends, is how you create drama out of thin air. From love triangles to secret agents, these nymphomaniacs sure know how to spice things up. Now let's dive into a narrative that's as thrilling as it is hilarious. Meet our protagonist, a woman who's not content with ordinary affairs. No, she's a secret agent in her own mind, entangled with international spies in a web of imaginary intrigue, She's not just any secret agent, though. No, she's the best in the business, codename Lustful Lynx. She's quick on her feet, sharp as attack, and her charm? Irresistible. She doesn't just catch spies, she captivates them. Her missions take her to exotic locations, from the glistening beaches of Monaco to the snowy peaks of the Swiss Alps. Each mission, a new handsome spy to seduce and secrets to uncover. And let's not forget about the high-speed chases, daring escapes, and heart-stopping near misses, all in a day's work for our nymphomaniac secret agent. But of course, this is all in her head. In reality, she's a regular Jane, working a nine-to-five job and coming home to a quiet apartment and her pet cat, Mr. Whiskers. But when she closes her eyes, the world transforms into her very own spy thriller. Her vivid imagination leads to some uproarious misunderstandings like the time she mistook her plumber for a Russian operative, or when she tried to defuse her new smart home device, convinced it was a time bomb. But she takes it all in stride, laughing at her own antics. She's a woman who knows how to make her life exciting. So what if it's all in her head? It's her world, and she's living it to the fullest. She's not just dreaming, she's creating her own reality, one international spy and secret mission at a time. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's raise a glass to the women who dare to dream, who embrace their fantasies and live their lives with a dash of imagination. Because really, who needs James Bond when you have your own secret agent fantasies, right? And now, for the piece de resistance, the wildest imagination of them all, the imaginary affair. Imagine a woman, let's call her Martha. Martha has a vivid imagination so much so that she's convinced herself she's having an affair with her neighbor's husband. Now, this isn't your run-of-the-mill daydreaming session. Oh no, this is a full-blown, technicolor, soap opera-worthy saga, complete with stolen glances over garden fences and clandestine meetings at the grocery store. Martha's imagination is her playground, and she's the star of her own show. 
She's got it all figured out, right down to the clandestine whispers in the produce aisle. Meet me by the cucumbers, she'd say, her heart pounding with the excitement of it all. What's more, she's decided to let her friends in on her secret, which is where things start to get really interesting. Now picture her friends, wide-eyed and open-mouthed, hanging on to every word of Martha's tall tale. They're consumed by this imaginary affair, discussing it over cups of coffee and slices of cake. Did you see the way he looked at her? They'd whisper, their imaginations running wild with Martha's. The gossip mill is in full swing, churning out juicy tales faster than a tabloid press. Misunderstandings abound as whispers of the affair spread like wildfire through their tight-knit community. The neighbor, poor unsuspecting soul, can't understand why he's getting the cold shoulder at the local pub. And his wife? She's bewildered at the sudden influx of sympathetic glances and hushed conversations that stop as soon as she walks into a room. Back at Martha's, she's having the time of her life, blissfully unaware of the chaos she's caused. The imaginary affair has taken on a life of its own, and Martha's friends are eagerly awaiting the next episode of the saga. But as with all good things, the imaginary affair must come to an end. The gossip dies down, the whispers fade away, and life returns to normal. Martha, however, remains undeterred, ready to spin another tale and ignite the gossip factory once more. Well, that escalated quickly, didn't it? Now that we have gone through some of the wildest stories, it's time for a quick recap. First up, we had the Nymphomaniac's Joke, where our heroine turned an innocent coffee date into an epic love saga, complete with star-crossed lovers and a dramatic breakup. All of this, mind you, from a single sip of cappuccino. Then we dove headfirst into the imaginary love triangle. Here, our leading lady managed to create a love triangle involving herself, her gym instructor, and her best friend's cousin's sister's boyfriend. Talk about six degrees of separation. Next up was The Secret Agent Fantasy, a tale that transformed a mundane work trip into an international spy thriller. Our heroine, armed with nothing but her vivid imagination, became an undercover agent, unearthing secret alliances and dashing off to exotic locations, all while sitting at her desk in the office. Finally, we explored the imaginary affair, where a simple like on a social media post sparked an illicit love affair, complete with clandestine meetings and secret messages. Who knew that a thumbs-up emoji could cause such a stir? And there you have it a whirlwind tour of the wildest, most hilarious stories that our nymphomaniac heroine has cooked up in her overactive imagination. Remember folks, these are just stories. Don't let your imagination run too wild or you might end up being the next gossip.